What a god. What's up? What's up, Pi? Pies? Pi 2 Z? Which character are you talking about? Are you talking about this character or are you talking about an earlier one, my home slice? Ice climbers. I'm talking about ice bro. climbers and snake, bro. Respect. I don't know how snake's boring, but I. Damn. Uh. Snake, I think it takes a certain taste to enjoy. So. How? It's it's snake. That's what I'm saying. Like, so the, most of the time the games like slow down a lot against Snake because people don't really know how to like punish his stuff. And so yes. if you are watching it and like you see two players like playing kind of slow because like that's how it is, then like it can be boring in that way, you know? Yeah. Like for me, I like Snake just because I think he's like hella free to play against. Hella free? You, you can do whatever the fuck you want and he dies. But that's just me. Same with that. Yeah. Reverse back here. Oh man, what the tech too. <laughs> Wasn't ready. Wasn't ready. Yeah, I think he tried to cipher, but he got the grenade. Oh my god. Oh I can't no. believe that worked. Oh. I can't believe that worked. I can't believe that didn't work. <laughs> wow. Oh. Dumpster. I've never seen 560 hit a clutch meteor in my life. Man, Still always me. misses it. Always misses it. Oh, that was gross as hell. 560 didn't bite, but that was that was some nasty ass shit. <laughs> that was some nasty ass shit. I guess, bro. You gotta respect it, man. Oh wow, I'm this is a dumpster, dude. In. The the dumpster heal. Uh -huh. Okay. Wave land, but get All right, oh, right the like, roll. Okay. Looks like 560 taking a lot more. Oh. Oh, he wanted to go for the bad manners, but it doesn't he wanted work. to go for the flip tool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely. I mean, I mean, what other options does he have there? Uh -huh. The thing is, like, um, the easiest way to get through the footstool setup is just air dodge, air dodge back on. And so, like, he'll either try to read you not air dodgy and just footstool, or he'll read the air dodge and like do a double jump back and pick an option, you know? Oh, I got you. Yeah, it's tricky. All right, that went a lot better. Five sixty had the first two stocks when he started like taking it slow. Yeah, it's, uh, yeah, he, he kind of played that a little bit. Yeah, it down there. At the beginning, he was just kind of running in. He was getting like walled out by Ganon, and then eventually he like did that thing where he dropped the sticky and then he just like crawled away. And that's, that, when, the, that's, that's, when, the, that's when the tides turn, baby. That's when the you tides turn. You just gotta do turn. the stupid, the stupid like soak and stuff. Man. Yeah, you gotta play, you gotta play fucking middle. You gotta game, play you know like you gotta, yeah, you gotta do it. You gotta play like Snake himself. Okay. Dang, Ink just destroying his controller though. Oh, there's no way. Oh, oh yeah, God, no, that, so there's, there's a way. There is a way. I know, but that is just so rude. He died. He died. A little bad on the sticky. So like when you're off scene, you got sticky on you. You gotta watch for the animation. Yeah. And then like when he pops it, you gotta make sure you're not diing towards him for the forward air setup. Oh, so you just so you just di away. Uh, it depends. If you are super far, I would just di straight up or like only slightly in. Mm -hmm. If you're like closer, yeah, you should di away. Oh, I got you. Just depends on like where. You detonate it, you know. Yeah, we're so you, you have position. That's interesting. That's a, uh, that's a. That's a thing. Mm -hmm. I would not have thought that. Oh, oh my god. SDing as Ganon. Life choices you don't have to make. Oh, oh no. He can change it right here though. No, oh, no. My come on. God, dude. Not, come on. Even a <laughs> fastballer wouldn't have made that. <laughs> what the hell? It's a very uh, P PM game so far. Yeah. This ain't, this ain't PM, this is just SD Remix. <laughs> this is SD Remix? Yeah, that's what it is. Oh, what the, oh, oh my god, oh! You get the meteor. The, get the meteor. If, I think if you went for the double dip, you would have gotten it. If you <laughs> like, dip. If you like activated it again right away, he would have gotten the second forward air, I think. <laughs> is it is it only a meteor in P+, plus, or is it... Uh, no, no, a, it is it's still, it's still a spike. A, it's still a spike. It just it's meant to hit box, yeah. yeah, so I thought. I was wondering. So I just don't fuck up, man. Okay. Alright, I do that that cipher up air thing, it feels so random half time, like it, it feels so inconsistent. Yeah, it is it does feel that way to me too. It's like partly SDI, but mostly I feel like it's just like you hit him with a weird part of the cipher. Man, man, he, he he's just, for dude, shit, bro. He's using his big feet. He's, he's got, got a the meteor, big feet. Bro. Like 560 already has kind of a hard time meteoring. But like with Ganon, there's like a little bit more hits done on his fucking shit because it's like electrical, I think. And so, like, that makes it even harder, you know? Because if you're already bad and then you got this extra factor, yeah. play it's over. That was hella nice edge cancel, hella nice read. Let's go get. Let's see, what's the comp? He, already, he has him there, doesn't he, or not? What's up? He no. has him stick, doesn't he? No, no, he missed, I think. I'm oh, pretty sure he missed. 
I think you're right, actually. Yeah, I didn't hear this. So right now in PUP Plus, it's like hella easy to tell because they have the little... Yeah, but I, I swear, sometimes it doesn't come on. Really? I mean, I, I, I mean, wouldn't know. I've, I I've, heard, I've heard a few people say like it just bugs out sometimes. It doesn't play the sound. I wouldn't know. I wouldn't know. But yeah. Oh my god. He, I, I've noticed that he's, uh, Soku hasn't been doing a lot of simple grenades. And I think in this matchup, particularly, it's pretty good. I mean, grenades grenade. is super good in Snake in general, but I think against Ganon, yeah. Ganon doesn't have a lot of ways to deal with grenades. And I, I if he combos you, you get out of it pretty well. He has to be super close to you, right? Yeah. So so what's been good about it so far is that, like, even though Gan doesn't really have the tools to deal with grenade, if he's far away, he's been, like, keeping the distance pretty tight between the two of them, you know? And when you're, like, right next to a Ganon, it's scary to pull out grenade, because if you guess wrong and he comes in, yeah. then, like, you're just kind of fucked. Yeah, he, I, yeah, like if you watch, he like kind of gets super close to him. He stays like relatively close. There are times where it is safe to pull though, and in those situations, it seems like he's opting for Trank or to close the space and push him in the corner rather than pull grenades. Yeah, so I, it could be a good mix. Of, I agree, it's like good mix up your options a little bit. So we're more like right there. You had plenty of time pull grenade there. Yeah, I just, oh, okay, I mean I know that was a combo. I don't. It definitely was not. I was there. <laughs> oh my god, just come down with that. <laughs> I thought it was a back air. Just, just let it know. Just let it know. Oh, with the back is okay. Oh, this is big. Game. No, no, it's not. Not it drops it. Was the raw? Okay. Well, it's, I don't think that was the, the punish option there. Yeah, I see what you're saying. If you guess wrong, Ganon just punishes you. Yeah. Like right there, up there, you're right. I just, yeah. Yeah, because, like, Ganon, Ganon doesn't really have any good way to approach, right? Because yeah. it kind of just walls. But, like, if he sees you pull grenades, like, all right, now it's my time to, like, pop in. Yeah, because you trap. Yeah, because if you're, if you're going to pull a grenade, a snake, like, you're always going to do that. You're, you're never going to hold it. You're always going to drop it. Yeah. In a wave dash, pretty much. Mm -hmm. It's scary, dude. Uh, Ganon's a lot about, like, being able to recognize when scary and when he's not and when he's not that's when you gotta like do your setups and shit yeah but when he's scary it's like oh my god don't push a button don't push a button when you're not sure Ooh, nice right out this is hard i feel like the sticky's on the floor which is not great so he's gonna go, and go for it i think you should just fourth <laughs> throw him <laughs> no oh, that, was, that, was, that, was, that was something else that was something else He's going for like a, a dumb. Oh no, he's the God. wrong way. He's throwing it. He's the wrong way. No, no. So like, it's always it's always a decent option to be like on the ledge, right? Yeah. During respawn, because you can just grab ledge and be invincible and try and wait it out. Yeah. So he was going for the box walk backward in instant ledge grabs, but he was turned the wrong way. So a box walk it. backward instant ledge grab? Is that a thing? Yeah. What the? That's it's stupid. It's a T plus thing. Yeah. Was, was oh my God. There's Is no that it? Oh! What, what a shitter! Clutch foot what a shitter! I've ever seen. What a shitter! Biggest clutch read of, of his life. What a shitter! And the running. Oh, that's not running. I don't even know what the last stage was. Pokemon Stadium, right? Pokemon, Pokemon Stadium. Uh, they they play two games on Battlefield though, so yeah. if they're both cool. The thing run back. Whatever they want. I mean, it's a good stage. I don't know why you wouldn't be. It, it's. I don't think either character has an advantage on Battlefield. Like too bad. I think they both do fine on the stage mm -hmm. without one being super dominant. He really likes that. He, he really likes that uh, side B from ledge yes. option. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. He's he's been doing shit, man. There's, just going in. Oh. I feel like if my man Yink really. Oh my god! Oh my god! The perfect shield and the he change. doesn't get it. The change. Okay, that's his three dax. He went for four. Nope. So technically, I found this out recently. What? That's actually a power shield, not a perfect shield. And apparently, there is a difference, which blew my fucking mind. There is? Yeah. So perfect shielding is, I believe, the brawl version, and it's like harder to do because I think it's only on the first frame. Oh, wow. But it does not reflect projectiles. Of course, power shielding is a little later, and it does. It's four frames. For power shielding. Yeah. Exactly. This is melee. It's four, it's four yeah, frames. Exactly. So like that one will reflect, whereas the power, the perfect shield will not. So, some kind of dumb stuff, I'll say That's that. I mean, I mean, it's a good change. Oh my god. From Ledge, dude. 
Uh, I mean, I think it's a good change that Snake gets punished for throwing out Tranquilizer. Cause... No, no, I'm saying, I'm saying, perfect shield versus power shielding is like kind of silly that there's both. Oh, is, is there both? In... There's both. Oh, there in is. One. That's why it's I like thought, I thought you were just saying like there's like like we've been using the terms like interchangeably no. when they're not. Um, yes, but also like they're just, they're like so is there any they happen to... like very So is there any reason to perfect shield then? I legit don't know because I found out about it like two days ago and I was like, just like blowing my mind. Yeah. I don't. I think like there might be less end lag on attacks when you perfect shield, oh. but like it's very hard to go for either anyway. So it's tough to tell. There. I'm surprised Ink hasn't gone for the anti snake setup. What is but that? I guess it hasn't been. So when you up the snake as Ganon, like. When he switches to the animation where he kind of like does yeah, the electric shit, yeah, yeah. he'll yeah, actually go. Yeah. He'll actually go high enough to get hit by the cipher, and so he'll instantly just drop you. But you won't like be able to jump or up you or anything. I think that's really weird. It's fucking stupid. It's just so weird. But like, <laughs> I think he hasn't been going high. I don't know. I feel like edge guarding snake should be pretty There's easy no. here because 560 is very bad in meteor canceling. So I would just step on him. Yeah, like right like, there he could have he could like right just, there, like, he just go for it. Yeah, and go for it. I don't think I don't think there's really mm -hmm. reason not to it up. There. Yeah. So go for it there and then like if he goes hide upbeat. I wanna see it. I wanna yeah. see the upbeat. <laughs> the upbeat? <laughs> yeah, I, uh, I I've never seen someone get his butt kicked this hard before, but this is a it's a pretty rough one. Yeah. So so Yink usually Yink usually like plays snake. Yeah, he's so a snake he, player, right? He, so he knows like a lot of shit about yeah. snake. But it's just like he, he hasn't well, been feeling people, and he's also not really playing, not really active, so he just goes same here, which I respect. Yeah, I mean, I know on, I know on Yink's uh, Smash Pedia page, it's him in a big boss outfit, yes. so I know he plays it. I was hoping he'd play it, but he hasn't played it yet today, which is kind of blows. Yeah, to maybe, maybe in Grand, I'm not sure. What? No, I was like, maybe in Grand if Katina Wolf goes, like, new to. Yeah. So we'll see. We'll see. This has actually gotten like actually a really yeah, good run back. As long as doesn't do stupid shit like getting hit with grenade, I think he can come back. That's part of Snake though. Oh, oh that, that was DI tough. was so bad. <laughs> that DI <laughs> was so shit. <laughs> oh man. All right.